Hey everybody, welcome to our weekend check-in video for WSTS 47 Intro to LGBTQ Studies for Saturday, December 10th. And as you likely realize, this is our last weekend check-in video, so thank you for coming. And I always like to make a few concluding remarks here. Uh, first up is that I did post the uh, ex scores for the uh, final exam there, so do take a look at those in our Canvas gradebook. And as part of that, I did also post an announcement on Canvas just letting you know that the final exam scores are there. And also, of course, that means you can see your final grade in the course there. So uh, do take a look at that final grade there on the Canvas gradebook. And do recall, per the policy, and the statements on our syllabus there there is a grading scale produced there for you and by the way i also just reproduced that grading scale there on that canvas announcement i was just mentioning because remember everything in this course is all about the total points you earn out of the total points possible across everything in the course so that's what determines your final grade most of you did just fine there so uh, do take a look at that and by the way there too uh uh, the Canvas gradebook is not calibrated to round up, so if you're borderline, like you're really close to the next highest letter grade, like say you got like an 89.5% or a 79.5% or such, uh, the Canvas gradebook is not going to round up. Unfortunately, it's just not calibrated to do that. I wish it was. I wish we had an option we could just click on our end of things on Canvas and just make it do that, but it doesn't give us that option. So uh, rest assured that if it shows your total points fall within a certain letter grading range despite what the uh, uh, canvas gradebook is telling you that's the grade that you will actually get is what is shown on the syllabus there but in case you're not sure you just want to double check feel free to reach out via an email and I'll confirm yes despite the fact that it shows you got a B on canvas it actually means you got an A in the course because you had total points that fell within the uh, final grade of A on our syllabus there so I uh, do keep that in mind there and apologies for any confusion but it's just something that we really don't have any control over as an instructor. I really wish they'd give us that option. Uh, next up here is there is a gradebook information module you'll find at the uh, bottom of our Canvas course page. So uh, please do uh, take a look at that there. It, I, it just restates what I was just telling you about the final point ranges for the grades and uh, also the Canvas gradebook not being calibrated, etc. there. So do take a look at that there. Uh, next up here, uh, I really enjoyed having you in the class. I think I mentioned uh, during the final there uh, earlier this week that this is my favorite class to teach because I primarily teach uh, psychology courses and they're mostly uh, heavy on the science. And so it's really nice for me to talk about things other than science. I mean, part of our course did deal with some of the science. You may recall the origin of homosexuality and the genetic stuff and all that there. So and then psychiatry, etc. But um, it's really fun to talk about other things. It's great to hear some of your stories, too and what you have to say and uh, I really appreciate uh, everybody that contributed to that uh, discussion there in class when I would ask you what what's anybody's experience here so I was really pleased to see that and otherwise uh, thank you for your kind remarks uh, when you were leaving the exam I really appreciate it uh, this is a very important course it's the only queer thing course we have across our whole district we're the only campus that has this course and there's only a single course in itself here so uh, let other folks know about it there uh, I will probably be teaching the course again uh, next fall uh, from what it's looking but we haven't gotten our schedules yet but I'm sure I'll be assigned to do it again so I look forward to that and uh, otherwise uh, I think some of you said that you were done this was the last course you had to take on you know in our district and you're moving on to another four-year school so best of luck to you there whatever you end up uh, pursuing as far as your major and definitely uh, keep in mind uh, what we learned in this course because as we all know I mean these can be pretty dark times unfortunately there's a really there's just some really great positive things happening too but you know politically etc. Uh, there's some problems right now and uh, people seem to want to uh, target queer folks uh, to move their agendas forward. They're just using us as a scapegoat and uh, that's uh, not unusual when you're a marginalized group and uh, people are unhappy with their country. Uh, they oftentimes scapegoat folks and uh, that's something I cover a lot when I cover prejudice in my uh, psychology courses. So it's just kind of a playbook and uh, we will get through this and things will get better and uh, people are going to mature and grow up things will evolve and a lot has happened especially in the last 50 years or so but uh, there's still a long way to go unfortunately you talk to anybody in a marginalized group they'll tell you the same thing yes there's progress but there's still a lot of room for improvement and there's still people that want to throw us right back to where we uh, were 50 years ago so we're uh, of course not going to let that happen so 
anyway, uh, best of luck to you. Enjoy your holidays there. Merry Christmas. You know, Happy New Year, however you celebrate things. Uh, enjoy your break, your time off, because I know I'm going to, because I, uh, I need it. <laughs> and uh, if you need anything, in the meantime, of course, reach out via email on Canvas, and I'll be glad to get back to you. Uh, otherwise, uh, again, take care, and uh, best of luck to you in your journey. All of you got a long life ahead, so uh, enjoy what's to come. All right, bye-bye.